Hi, I'm Phil Handy and I'm the Managing Director here at Handy Compact Tractors and Machinery. Today I'm here to show you a virtual viewing of this Terravac Colt. So, to start off with, we have a 50mm ball hitch, which is capable of hitching up to most 4x4s and quad bikes. And we can remove this by simply removing this pin. And we have a clevis hitch, so you can hitch it up to a ride on mower or a small tractor. We also have a ground scoop here, so this, if you didn't want to get on and off your quad bike whilst you're picking up your debris around your paddock, you can, sit, you can simply use this by adjusting this, getting this chain off, and it will run on the ground. As so, you have a wheel here, so you can run it on the ground and it isn't going to foul the grass. And you all rotate, so your spins around nicely. As you come closer, we also have a wander hose here, which is currently around the other side at the moment, but we can switch between the two simply by moving this lever, bring this up, and that allows to use the, the earth scoop or the wander hose. As easy as that. We also have a hydraulic tip, which is all operated on this lever here. If I close this tap up, I can pump this away and it will tip up for me. Again, I let the tap off and it comes back down to working again. If you come around this side, and this is a Vanguard 9 horsepower petrol engine. We have a fuel tank on the top here, we have our throttle and choke controls down here, and we also have an electric start on the key here. We also have the advantages of a poor start, should our battery go flat, we can carry on running it. This is our Wonder hose that I was previously telling you about. He simply lifts off, and you can take it all the way around, lifting it off. And this gives us the freedom to move around whilst picking up debris around the paddock. I'm going to do this here for the moment. Now if you'd like to come around the back here a moment and I'll show you inside the machine. So we have two over centre latches here. I'll open up these and this allows us our rear door to open up. As you can see, the first thing you see inside, we've got a block of wood on the inside of the door here. This is to protect any debris that comes out of the chute to stop it firing through the back door. Although this is metal, when it comes out of the chute, it will, any stones that are picked up, it will come out like a bullet. So this wood is to protect it. And as you see, if you want to have a closer look inside here, it is a nice solid floor. And our chute is right up the top back there. I'll close this up now. This has a nice little hook right there, so it keeps it all out the way whilst you're in transport. Now I'm going to hitch, show you hitching this up to my truck, and we're going to go around the corner, and we're going to pick up some debris and start it up. Left the ground scoop down. We do have a nice jockey wheel here, so we can adjust this up and it makes it nice and easy to hitch it onto my truck here. As you can see, as I unscrew this, the hitch will go up. For the purposes of this video, I'm simply just going to lift it up. He's not overly heavy and hitching it up is as easy as that. I'll tuck this jockey wheel up out the way so it doesn't foul the ground whilst I'm moving. Now I'm just going to move around the corner over there and we'll start up and have a go. Okay, 
Okay, so we're now in position. I'm going to show you how to start it. I'll show you a bit running. We're going to have a go at picking up some debris. If you'd like to follow me, go back round to the other side of the machine where all the controls are. Right, so first I'm going to make sure my choke is on. I'm going to give it a little bit of throttle. I'm going to turn my ignition on and then I'm going to start it. As you can see, the engine starts well, it runs nice. We managed to pick up some of the wet stuff as well as the dry stuff. Now we're gonna have we're gonna tip it up so you can see how we empty it. So again, we're gonna undo our two latches here and here. Open this up. You don't want to be opening this up whilst the engine is running because it will fly debris out at you and it's not safe. We have a chain on the other side so we can latch our door back. And that holds that back nicely. Now, as I showed you before, we're gonna tip it up now and empty out all the debris. So just like that, all our debris is out of the machine. I can close it back down now and we can go again. Just like that, we're all done, we're ready to go again. Thank you for watching, if you have any questions, 
please don't hesitate to message me or you can call me on our phone number which is 01380-722-418 or my mobile number is 0787-999-3439. Thank you.